Hi there. It's January the 29th, and in today's readings in chapters 8 and 9 in Exodus, in the Torah, we're seeing the unfolding story of the judgment of Egypt, and particularly of its gods. Many of the things that uh, are the plagues are directed against are represented by um, non-gods of the Egyptians. So, for instance, there's a frog-headed god, there's a fly-headed god, there's a cow-headed god, and all of these are things which the plagues are directed against. In fact, Pharaoh himself saw himself and was seen as divine by the people. And so every time there's a plague, Pharaoh believes that his power is greater than the power of God. Of course, during this uh, ep during these episodes, his magicians him themselves are unable to reproduce the signs and the wonders that God is doing. And actually, by the time of the hail, they themselves are recognising that God is God, and they're taking cover, and they're putting their cattle away because they know that God is God, and there is no one like him, as Moses keeps saying. But Pharaoh's heart is heavy, his heart is hard, and because he sees himself as God too, he sets himself against the one maker of heaven and earth. And when we set ourselves against God, when any man sets himself or woman sets herself against God, there's only one outcome. There's only going to be one winner. And so we will see gradually Pharaoh being worn down and eventually recognising who God really is and that the Lord God is the one true God of the whole earth. Have a good January the 29th.